Alright guys, here we are at King's Crossing Outlet. We're heading out to a foodie spot, not closed, foodie spot called, I think it's called Damascus. Yeah, I think it's Shawarma Damascus. Yes, that's what it's called. So I'm just gonna swing around. It's at the other side. Go. Right by the winery. Wow, perfect. Look at that. They're not open. Shit! They're not open. Crap, they said they open at 11. They're not open. They're not open till 1 o'clock. That's terrible. We will not be doing that review. Right, guys, here we go. Damascus. Swarm of Damascus. How you doing? I didn't know you didn't open till later today. I was here at 11 o'clock hoping to get the early lunch. It's like, oh. did not happen. That's okay. Oh, boy. Uh, I'll take the combo large uh, chicken shawarma wrap combo thing. Uh, yeah, garlic potatoes. Yeah, that's your specialty there? Is that your specialty? That's your. Oh no no definitely definitely potatoes. Yeah. It's potato. Yep, for sure. Lots of chili, lots of garlic, whatever you put onto it. Uh, when you describe spicy, are we talking North American spicy or burn my face off? Well I have spicy garlic and I have hot peppers and I have hot sauce on top so you no. can choose three, you can choose one, you can choose two. I will just go with a little bit of the spicy this is uh yeah, spicy, yeah. So by the name, I assume it's a Syrian base, Middle East base, oh, yeah. not Lebanese or anything like that specifically. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to Newbie Views. All right, today, I don't know if you can see it out the window, but we are at Damascus Shwarma, or Shwarma Damascus. I do apologize, I'm not sure, didn't even look. All right, today I'm back in the car from what you just saw, looks like authentic Syrian base. So I got their combo. It's $15.99 plus tax, $18.05. So, oh, the bag cam. So what do we get? Let's let's open up the bag cam. I don't have any room. Kind of swish it over here. All right. Number one, garlic potatoes. That's the side I went with. You can go with rice, veggies, and all that sort of crap. I went... Oh my god. Oh, do you see the steam? What the heck? Wow, that is a take on french fries, my friends. And I smell the potato. That smells beautiful. Okay. I know they gave me a fork somewhere. Okay, in the bag they gave us a fork combo. Shite. camera's falling down okay hold on all right let's give these guys a shot so they put some sort of garlic sauce on it and potato wise oh my god oh my god that is so garlicky oh my god garlic oh my god that is so delish. How do they get it so creamy? Oh my god. Good strong hint of garlic. Oh that that even tastes like that even tastes like homemade. You know how you get you know how you get gravy that is you know how you get sauces that are so watered down? Oh wow, this is fantastic. Gonna get a quick Instagram, I forgot folks. That's a lot of garlic sauce. That is fantastic. I, I could eat all this and not be unhappy. Oh! How do I describe this pillowy? This is kind of like meringue of garlic sauce. Oh, I just know it's blended super tough, but I've never had this. Everybody else is liquidy garlic. Oh! Mmm. Okay. I can't eat all this because this is too good. 
I broke the lid. Oh my God. That is so amazing. All right, put that down. So, was $18 between the tax inside the bag cam. I think you can see the bag cam. I got a, napkins and I got plastic. Okay. So here's the shawarma. Now chicken shawarma is a wrap. I'm gonna open it up for you guys. So it looks like to put hummus at the base, some sort of garlic sauce. It is grilled. I just don't want to eat the paper. This is going to be messy. Chicken came off the rotisserie spinner. Okay. I need the I need an Instagram, guys. Hold on a sec. All right. There's hummus, there's onions, cilantro, and uh, chicken. You could got gotten beef as well, but I went with chicken. Mmm. Oh my God. What is that? This is insane. If you've had, ever had fast food joint vegetables, you know it's not fresh, it's been this is super fresh. I think it's mint. Mmm. Oh my god. It's parsley. It's got pickled turnips, pickles, onions. It sounds like a little tabbouleh, which is like a parsley salad. Hummus, garlic sauce. They offered it to make it spicy, but no, I, I said give me a little bit of spicy garlic. I don't taste the spice. I should ask for more. Hmm. This is super fresh. Oh my gosh. Mm. Now I also saw them making falafels fresh. I should have got an order, but I didn't. Now this is a large. They also have a small. This is way too much food for me. Wow. Mm-hmm. It's currently around four o'clock. I waited all day for this. It's not bad. Oh my God. Mm. Now you probably know he, one of these uh, shawarmas, you slowly unwrap it, exposing more of the sandwich. But you leave the foil on because all the juices get stuck at the bottom and your diaper holds it all in. Just just look at all that veggies. There's tons of tabbouleh in here or cilantro or whatever it is. It's pretty darn fresh. Mm-hmm. It definitely has that raw, fresh flavor.
All right, I'm going to finish this off, guys, and we'll see you on the flip side. All right, we're back. I'm going to have a few of these garlic potatoes. Oh, my God. These are divine. Wow. Wow. Oh, my God. That is so good. Honestly, I don't know how anybody could finish this off in one sitting. Mm. All right. I can't have any more. Okay, folks, that was Damascus. Yeah, Shawarma Damascus. Uh, here at Dalton Avenue at the King's Crossing Mall. What a great place to go get some cheap clothes or outlet clothes. Uh, Tommy Hilfinger, Columbia, Adidas, a whole bunch of stuff, Puma. And then stop in for a bite or charge your Tesla over there. <sighs> Shawarma, Damascus, that was a four out of five. I don't know what else to tell you. It's fresh. Those veggies are fresh. You could definitely tell it was like just cut as if you were cut at home. The sauce is amazing. The garlic sauce, you must get that garlic potatoes. Oh my gosh. Uh, just get the small though. The big I find really big. And what else? That's it. If you like shawarmas, this is the place to definitely try one out. I find that the chicken was a little salty for my liking, but it's roasted well, cut off the spit, and uh, it was plentiful. All right, that's it, guys. Don't forget to hit the like button. Uh, don't forget to hit subscribe if you're not a subscriber. And I will try to find other shawarmas to kind of determine whether they are the number one, because this is the only first one I've had here in town next to some donairs so the answer is they're number one so far so the reputations yeah let's let's say they're number one for now because i don't have any other thing to go by all right that's it until then we'll see you in the next video peace out